Welcome to CAD Productivity's video tip on inserting and deleting PIs in SS4 Civil Geometry. The horizontal geometry tools in SS4 do not contain insert and delete PI commands. However, you do have similar functionality. Here I have an alignment generated with horizontal geometry tools. And if I need to remove a PI, I can go to my MicroStation Modify tools select delete vertex. When I pick the curve, the first delete is the curve itself, leaving the PI, but if I want to also remove the PI, I just choose the PI and it is removed as well. You might think, well, I could zero out the curve, but if you zero out a curve, it leaves an error telling you that the curve radius of 0 is not valid and I would have to choose that radius and delete that to have a PI by itself. Then of course I could use the delete vertex to remove the PI. If you would like to insert a PI then you've probably already guessed that you can use the insert vertex. So I choose insert vertex, identify the tangent, identify the location of the new PI and it is inserted into the civil geometry. In addition to the insert PI, I do have a tool to insert the PI and a curve at the same time. It's called horizontal insert fillet. When I choose that command, identify the tangent, locate the new PI, and if I reset at this point, it inserts the PI alone. I'm going to delete that vertex and insert the fillet again. This time after giving it the location for the PI I can type in a radius, accept, and it will insert the radius as part of the alignment. Thanks for watching. Be sure to check out our new training manual on upgrading to En-ROADS SS4.